We are learning new information about a cyber attack at the Madison County Jail. The sheriff's office says hackers got access to information and images not generally available to the public. Way 31's Alex Torres Perez joins us live from the jail. She has more on what the sheriff's office is doing to address this issue. Alex. Unfortunately, there wasn't much the Madison County Sheriff's Office could have done to actually prevent this cyber attack, and that's because they weren't the ones who were actually attacked. The hackers got access to an elevated account of the company the Sheriff's Office contracted, which then gave hackers access to the jail security cameras. Security is never 100%. Peyton Guy is a cybersecurity engineer at H2L Solutions in Huntsville. He says there was nothing the sheriff's office could have done to prevent this hack. This was just totally a fumble on the Verkata uh, company. This company did not have their account secured, and they were a supplier for very major companies in the United States and actually international as well. Bloomberg reports a group of hackers were able to get access to live feeds of more than 150,000 Verkata surveillance cameras in hospitals, schools, companies, police departments, and prisons. I reached out to the school districts in Madison County and Huntsville Hospital. They all said they were not impacted by this hack. However, the Madison County Sheriff's Office says it just installed Verkata's camera system at their jail at the end of last year. Officials said they weren't doing any on-camera interviews at this time, but did release a statement saying, quote, We are confident that this unauthorized release did not and will not impact the safety of staff or inmates in the detention facility or the general public. Bloomberg reports hackers were able to access live feeds and archived video in the jail. Some cases included audio of interviews between officers and criminal suspects. The sheriff's office says the security cameras are now offline, meaning they're no longer connected to the internet and hackers can no longer access them. Officers are still using the cameras to monitor inmates from the jail's control room viewing stations. Sheriff Kevin Turner says, quote, we will continue to focus our efforts on the safety and security of our community, which remains our first and foremost priority. The sheriff's office says that the hack did not impact any other system at the jail. Reporting live in Huntsville, Alex Torres Perez, Way 31 News. Thank you, Alex. The cybersecurity engineer says hacking is always a risk when using an outside security company, and there's only one way to make sure that you are 100% protected from a hack. 